When teachers union president Michael Mulgrew was asked on the PIX11 morning news if we might be facing a teacher shortage in the city this fall, three words. We might be. A big development. We're seeing a teacher shortage across the entire country. New York City's always been able to stay outside of that, but I don't know if, we're, if that's going to continue. I think we might start seeing a shortage for the first time in a while. Nationwide, a majority of school leaders report a shortage of teachers for fall. In suburban areas, 60% say they have a shortage, 65% say that in rural areas, and in the nation's cities, 75% of schools say they are lacking teachers. There was a shortage. It wasn't so noticeable that everybody was like, hey, where's the rest of the teachers? But, you know, there was some, you know, there was a little shortage. Scared that they're not going to get the education they need. Parents told us they're worried. Barry Dorsonat's son has special needs, and there weren't enough teachers to fully help him this school year. I couldn't find uh, speech to come for the whole year. I'm just hoping this year will be better. But Mayor Bill de Blasio says there's no need for concern. There is a long, long line of people who want those jobs. So I do not see uh, any danger of a shortage. The DOE also said it's got 900 new teaching fellow trainees, up from 75 last year, plus 300 paraprofessionals training to be teachers, up from 25, and a total of 1,250 new hires for some of the neediest students. But that's less than 2% of all teachers. And a leader of a parents' organization who also hires teachers says far more than that are leaving. You know, in my son's school, um, we're having a turnover. About a third of our teachers um, are leaving. Um, and I know it's happening across the district. Now, the mayor says that if his administration concludes that there is a shortage of teachers, they will take action. But at this point, he says, they don't anticipate a need to do so. Reporting live from the Windsor Terrace neighborhood of Brooklyn, I'm James Ford, PIX11 News.